Hello, 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 y'all. How is everybody? How was everybody's weekend? What did everybody do? Hopefully you stayed away from the madness that is out there, I hope. Cause y'all, it's crazy. It is crazy. Um, y'all, I don't know like what is up with everybody. It's nuts. It's nuts. All right, so I'm going to send out that invite to everybody. And then we're gonna get started. Hello, hello, y'all. When you jump on, say hi, what's up, how are you doing? We are set, we are showing paparazzi jewelry tonight. Everything is $5, it's all lead and nickel free. Tonight, we are doing sets. Hey, Cheryl, we are rocking the sets tonight. Hey, Jesse. Hey, Sarah. Oh, y'all. I'm loving this group thing. Hey, Mom. Hey, Christina. Oh, my gosh, yes. I'm loving this group invite, y'all. I would still be sitting here sending out invites to literally everybody on my list, and y'all are just popping on right now. This is amazing. I love it. Thank you, Cheryl. Thank you, Sarah. Y'all, this is awesome. I love it. Love it. Thank you, Christina. All right. So now. How's everybody's weekend been? You staying away from the madness and the craziness that is going on out there? I hope. So, uh, Ryan, <laughs> y'all, he's got some cojones, let me tell you. This man decided to venture out last night. Venture out last night. And just go shopping for... I don't know. I don't know. He texted me at one point in time. What well, was yesterday? I shouldn't say last night. It was yesterday. Um, texted me at one point in time and told me he was at Star Nursery and asked me if I needed anything from Star Nursery. And I was like, well, what could I possibly need from Star Nursery? Like, really? <laughs> yes. That is how Ryan's mind works. Yes. So he decided to, you know, I mean, I get it. I get it because I want to do the same thing. But let's face it. We live in Vegas. That is where things come to die. Okay. It just is what it is. Things come to die here. So 
we both would love to have a garden and grow our own stuff and all of that fun jazz, but it's just not possible here. Well, this man decided to go out and purchase all of these plants and herbs and vegetables and all of this stuff and brought them home yesterday. And I'm like, what the heck are you going to do with all of those? He goes, I'm going to plant them. And I'm like, why? They're going to die. He goes, I don't know. I just want to and I can. Um, and tried to convince me that it was a great deal to do and all of this and that. Well, okay, so let me tell you another thing about Ryan. He's not exactly really smart. I mean, he's like total typical guy. You know, he kind of just like does things out of the spur of the moment and doesn't really think things through, you know, like the guy thing. So... I could have seen it if he would have bought, you know, full-blown plants already that, you know, were on the verge of producing vegetables and fruit and whatever. No. He bought the tiniest little plants that he could probably find in this place, I'm telling you. So, yes, by the time they get big enough to even produce vegetables and all of that fun jazz, um... It's going to be so stinking hot here that it's literally just going to kill them. It's going to bake them and they're all going to die. I'm like, oh. that has been my life this weekend. Um, he asked, <laughs> hey, Wendy, he asked me if I wanted to go shopping with him yesterday. And I was like, if you want to bail me out of jail, I'll go. If you'd rather not do that, then I'm going to stay home. He's like, oh, come on, it's not that bad. And I'm like, oh, you'll see, just wait, just wait. So yes, he went to, you know, other places like Star Nursery and whatever first. And he was like, it's not so bad outside. And I'm like, yeah, but that's because you're where all the people are not. So yes, then when he came to, you know, going to Walmart and, you know, the grocery stores, then he texted me and he was like, babe, holy crap. People are like utterly retarded. And I was like, see, I told you. Y'all, he went to two stores. Two stores, that's it. And he texts me and he goes, I am coming home. This is insane. I am, this is nuts. I, I cannot deal with people anymore. I'm not doing this. I'm coming home. I'm like, see? And then you wanted me to go? No, that's not a good thing. Not a good thing. So that's been my weekend, y'all. All right. So. If you all saw the post today, saw the post that I put on my page, we're playing a new game tonight called Lingo. B-L-I-N-G-O. Lingo. It is going to be just like bingo. Um, so same, same thought process behind all of that, okay? So, so far, the only people that I have had that chose numbers have been my mom and Adrienne. Okay, I know my mom is on here. Adrienne, have you jumped on yet or no? Um, if you're on here, Adrienne, say hi. Um, those of you who have not chosen numbers yet, I'm gonna give you a couple minutes to comment your numbers that you want to choose, okay? You choose five numbers between one and 40. One and 40, five numbers, comment them here, that way I have them, then write them down for yourself so you know. What's gonna happen is through periodically throughout the show, I'm gonna show jewelry and then I will, um, I will hold up a number and it's going to be, um, and I will let you know, this is your first Blingo number. This is your second Blingo number, whatever the case is, okay? You guys, make sure you cross them off, just like bingo, okay? Um, the first person to get all five of their numbers, comment Blingo, yell out Blingo, and you are going to win free jewelry. Okie dokie. Everybody understand? So, I have the stack of numbers here. I'm going to get these all shuffled up while you guys let me know your blingo numbers. 
Um, my consultants on here, you guys already know you can't play, I'm sorry. But everybody else, let me know what your numbers are. One through 40, pick five numbers, one through 40. That's okay, Wendy, I'm giving y'all a chance right now. Right now. Pick five numbers, one through 40, message them here to me. Um, because once I start, I'm sorry if you come in late, um, I'm not going to run back through the numbers that I've already called. Okay. So you have to give them to me now before we start the show, you have to write them down. Um, and you have to be present to win, obviously, because if you don't yell blingo, then, you know, I mean, I'm just going to keep going. All right. Yeah, I need to get like bigger cards or make cards or something. These little cards, like they are hard to shuffle. <laughs> so, so far I have mom's numbers and Adrienne's numbers, but I don't think Adrienne's on. Um, so everybody else, message me your numbers, y'all. Message them to me. Ah, I'm dropping numbers. I'm throwing them around. Oh, really? Sorry, y'all. Hold on. This one went far. Oh, yeah. All right, Cheryl, we got you down. Four, two, five, 16, 19, and 40. All right. Who else, y'all? Who else? Get them in here. I was telling you guys the other night on the live, um, I didn't really like to play Family Feud because yes, not everybody's delay is the same, unfortunately. Um, so yes, some of you guys were, um, some of you guys were seeing the, or hearing the questions before anybody else. And so therefore you got, you know, kind of, um, you kind of got like a first chance, you know, and so that really wasn't fair to everybody else. So I was telling you guys that I, I'm trying to come up with new games to play, you know, that make it more fair to everybody, you know. Hi, Adrian. Welcome, welcome. All right, Wendy. We got you for five, eight. 23. Okay. Got you, Wendy. All right. So, so far for Blingo, we have my mom, Adrian, Cheryl, and Wendy. Who else is on here that would like to participate in Blingo? You got to get them in now um, because once I start, that's it. Um, I'm not going to run back through numbers again if you came in late. Um, I'm not going to recall numbers. So make sure you guys have your numbers wrote down and be keeping track of them. Um, I will show some pieces of jewelry and then I will, thank you Adrian, and then I will call a number and we will go from there, all right? Um, you obviously have to be present to win because you have to yell out blingo when you get all five numbers, okay? So who else here does not have numbers given to me yet that wants to play? Right now we have Mom, Adrian, Cheryl, and Wendy. So far that's all we got. You want to play blingo? Get them in. I'm going to start showing jewelry. Um, and then you're, you're going to have a couple minutes to get me those numbers in, okay? A couple minutes to get them in. We are doing sets tonight. I know. Welcome back to Sunday sets. I know. It's been a while. I actually have my board sitting right here next to me again. I feel like I am a 
accomplishing something tonight. I don't know. I'm getting my life in order, y'all. <laughs> it's been chaos the last few weeks. So we are back to Sunday night sets. Um, I lost count of how many sets I put together on this board when I was doing it, so I have no idea how many are here. They do not have to be purchased in a set, okay? Um, if you want the whole set, like for instance, this is going to be set number 79. So if you want the whole set, you're just going to comment 79 set or 79 earrings, 79 bracelet, 79 necklace, whatever the case it decides to be in the set if you only want to purchase one or whatever pieces, okay? You don't have to purchase them in a set, all right? So make sure y'all are getting your blingo numbers in. Actually, you know what? I'm going to pin that in the comments right now. That way I don't have to keep repeating it. I should have put it in the description, but I forgot. Oh, can't spill tonight. Okay. I'm going to pin that in the comments. That way y'all see that. Um, all right. So we're going to get started. Y'all have um, probably this set and maybe the next one to get your numbers into me. And that's it. I'm going to start. Okay. Number 79. This is a two piece set. Two piece set. We have, it is your black and your rhinestones black and your rhinestones so this is the bracelet it is like a version of a tennis bracelet super pretty black is your metal color you have those gorgeous rhinestones it does have your lobster claw and your extender so you can play with the length on that make it wherever you want it to be okay so there is your bracelet. We have it paired with your exact matching earrings. Or not, because I just noticed that a stone fell out of that one. So no, I'm sorry, we're scratching that set. Scratching that set. I don't know what happened when I put them on the board. It was there. All right, scratching that set. Moving on. Number 88. Number 88. Two piece set again. You have your cuff style bracelet in silver, split shank. Your medallion on the front of that is that beautiful milky white stone there in the center, and it has your gorgeous crackle that runs through it. Beautiful. We have it paired with the matching earrings. Matching earrings. So this stone, this milky white stone is the exact same as the bracelet exact same crackle and all you have silver fish hooks all the way through down here into this gorgeous um leaf pendant super pretty so that is set number 88 set number 88 like i said it does not have to be purchased in a set you can say it's 88 earrings 88 necklace and we'll do one or the other or 88 set and both pieces will be yours all right okay you all ready for blingo you all ready 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 First blingo number of the night. 15. First blingo number of the night. Number 15. If you have 15, cross it off. First person to get all five of your numbers, you're going to 
yell out blingo and you are going to win free jewelry. What up, Susie? First blingo number, number 15. Everybody got it? Okay. All right, let's see here. Let's see, let's see. Put Ryan in a tutu. Yeah. Hashtag Ryan in a tutu movement, y'all. We are counting down. Um, I am just, uh, I am going to count down. I'm going to update. I'm sorry, not count down. I'm going to update where we're sitting um, at the end of the live tonight. Um, because I still, unfortunately, have some unpaid invoices out there. So if those don't get paid, unfortunately, they get put back into stock, which means, therefore, they don't count towards the countdown. So um, I'm just I'm just waiting for some. Uh, thank you. I'm just waiting for the rest of the invoices to be paid and then we're going to do that. Number 83. This is a two piece set. Two piece set. You have your bracelet, which is stretchy. It has a beautiful, very light gray center stone in all of the medallions that run all the way through this. We have it paired with your big back ring in silver and the exact matching stone. Exact matching. Y'all, I couldn't have done that again if I tried. These were ordered at two separate times, and who would have thought it would have been the exact same color? Not me. So, number 83, two-piece set, ring and bracelet. All of pap paparazzi's rings, you guys know, are stretchy. Are meant to fit between a size six and a ten. My two fingers here are an eight and a nine and as you can see it's no problem on me. I can put it wherever I want and it goes on just fine. It doesn't, this ring is a size seven on me and as you can see like it doesn't fall off. It's good. I can wear it on my thumb for you thumb people out there that love the rings on them. You can put it wherever you want. So number 83 for that two-piece set. Y'all, let me tell you, it is nice to have my board back up here next to me. Oh my gosh. I didn't realize how much I would miss this thing. <laughs> All right. Next lingo number, 31. 31. That is your second lingo number. Make sure you guys are crossing them off. 31 is your second Blingo number. If you guys are just joining um, and would like to participate in Blingo, you need to message me. You can comment on here your five numbers, one through 40, okay? One through 40, five numbers, and you will be put in there. Hi, Fran. Welcome, welcome. For those of you who attended my flash sale this afternoon, you would have seen this set, number 48. This is a two-piece identically matching set from directly from Paparazzi. It is a short necklace set in gold, and it is oh so gorgeous. There's your earrings that come with this piece. The earrings on this are a beautiful, um, like creamy white and a champagne color. And you'll see better on the necklace. So there's your chain into your necklace. Look at these beautiful colors on here. You have amber, you have champagne, you have that milky white color. You have um, like a really, really light, um, I can't think of the, the color now. Um, 
like an iridescent gold in there. And it's super, super gorgeous. All those different colors, absolutely beautiful. And it comes with the exact matching bracelet. Exact matching. So there is two piece set necklace and bracelet number 48. Number 48. Again, pieces do not have to be purchased in a set. You can mix and match, do your own thing, whatever you want to do. They don't have to be purchased together. If you want just the bracelet, you can holler out 48 bracelet. Just the necklace, 48 necklace, so on and so forth, okay? Next blingo number, 23. 23. Third blingo number, 23. Mark it off your list if you got it. First person to get all five wins free jewelry. This next set is a four piece set. Absolutely gorgeous, if I do say so myself. Number 70. This is a short set. The earrings that go with this, it is all silver, y'all, all silver. So the earrings that go with it, your chain into your pendant, you have that little medallion that is fully encrusted in your rhinestones. Beautiful. Short, you're looking right around in there. We have, because not everybody likes just the tiny little earrings that come with it. So we have paired it with your upgraded earrings. Those beautiful halos in the rhinestones. And these ones are super cool. There's texture to them. Look at that. They have a wavy design to them. Very pretty. We have it paired with, now because this is all silver, of course you can do whatever you want, but I've paired it with this one and I'm actually gonna take it off the card because these ones show better off the card. So we have it paired with this style of bracelet. This has the curved um, metal link on either side of this. So it really hugs your wrist. It is a daintier um, bracelet. As you can see, it just hangs there because it has the curve to it. And that is your bracelet, that fully encrusted heart. And then we have it paired with your big back ring in silver and your fully encrusted rhinestone ring. Beautiful. So four piece set there y'all, four piece set. Number 70, four piece set. Like I said, it does not have to be purchased in a set. You can comment 70 ring, 70 bracelet, 70 necklace, 70 earrings, or the whole entire set, and you will get all four pieces in your basket. I only have one of each of these pieces. That's it. Number 70. What y'all think? Are you like super excited to have sets back? I know we kind of like really didn't do sets for a long time. What do y'all think? You like having the sets back? I know some of y'all like really loved the sets. 
um, because it kind of took guesswork out of it for y'all. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. All right, next lingo number 30. Lingo number 30. That was your fourth lingo number. So y'all, there is still time, okay? There's still time. You can get in on the blingo. I've only called four numbers so far. Um, at the very end, I am going to run through quickly. I will run through the numbers that were called to double check. Everybody can double check, make sure that they have or do not have the numbers. So if y'all still wanna participate, you can, okay? Okay, set number 47 is a three-piece set. Three-piece set number 47. It is black and hematite. Number 47, short. So there is your earrings that come with this. Black is your metal. Hematite is the stone for the earrings into your chain and your necklace. So the necklace is super cool. They alternate sizes and colors. So you have hematite and black, hematite and black, and they also vary in size. You can see that you have small going to the large here in the middle. The so black and hematite, you're looking right around in there. Y'all, this necklace is absolutely gorgeous. Why? because all of the stones are faceted. So even though there's not rhinestones on this piece, you see how it catches the light and it looks like some of those are covered in rhinestones? It's because they're faceted. So all of those cuts on that stone is hitting the light, and picking it up and throwing it back to you. Beautiful. So that is your necklace for that set. We have upgraded the earrings to the um, hematite starburst earrings. Beautiful. So these are all hematite stones in here, which match the um, necklace. We have you paired with a little back ring in silver and your hematite stones on the front there. They are all marquee shapes sitting sideways. Beautiful. So that is three piece set number 47. Number 47. earrings I do have two of these earrings um, everything else I only have one of so three piece set number 47 next blingo number eight blingo number eight Lingo number eight. We are gonna call two numbers here. Next, lingo number 28. Lingo number 28.
We had two numbers there, number eight and number 28. I'm gonna figure out which one I wanna show y'all next. <laughs> All right, three piece set, number 81. Three piece set number 81. It is a long set. So silver's your metal, there's your earrings to go with it. This is a layered look, so you have two layers here. So your first one is that beautiful little rhinestone that sits there on the first layer. And your second one is that beautiful bar pendant. Fully encrusted in your rhinestone. Look at that. The bar pendant. Beautiful. So layered look, y'all. That's your necklace. We have it paired with these beautiful things, and I have two available of these ones, so if you want the earrings, that's fine too. You have all of the, um, the tassels in here. You have plain silver ones, and then you have two that are rhinestones in there. Extremely lightweight, y'all. Both of these earrings combined still weigh less than the cardstock. Extremely lightweight. We have it paired with big back ring in silver and your rhinestones. Woo! There is seven rows of rhinestones on this bad boy. Seven rows. It has a little tiny dome shape to it. Absolutely beautiful. So three piece set there long, I don't know if I'm going to get this one to go, long set, there you go, number 81, number 81, three piece set, I do have two of the earrings available. If anybody wants just the earrings, that is totally fine to you. I have two available. Next Blingo number three. Number three Blingo number. We're gonna call out two here. So your next lingo number is seven. Lingo number seven. Next set. Four piece set. Four piece set. It is another long set. Red and silver, y'all. Red and silver. Number 51 four piece set. It is silver with your red pearl like stones. Long. This is your necklace. It is so super cool. You have your red pearl like stones in there, and you have different symmetrical shapes that run through this necklace. It is so pretty. All the way down. We have it paired with, because maybe that's a little too much red for you, you kind of want to tone it down. We have it paired with just a simple um, silver earring there. Again, very, very lightweight, just simple. A classic piece that every girl should have, just throw on good to go with everything earrings. Paired with a set of three. 
bangles with that same pearl-like red stone on two of them. And then you have one plain silver one. If you wanted more than three, I do believe I actually have two sets of these, so you could, you could definitely pair these up multiples and have a bigger set of bangles if you chose to. Fourth piece on this is big back ring in silver with your red. Now this is not pearl, it's moonstone, but as you can see, it goes beautifully. So there is your four piece set for that one, number 51. Number 51. All right. Lingo number six. Lingo number six. Lingo number twenty six. Lingo number 26. Lingo number 21. Lingo number 21. I'm kind of calling out multiples now because um, I want to get through them all before we show all the jewelry. So, lingo number 21. Lingo number two. Lingo number two. All right, two-piece set, two-piece set, number 61. These are your earrings. I do have two available of these ones. This is silver, and your top and the bottom has been dipped in your hematite rhinestones, and then you have that beautiful pink center stone there. I have two available of these. We have it paired with big back ring in silver and the exact matching color in your ring. So you have those marquee shapes are the exact same color pink, and then you have the hematite rhinestones on either side of those. Absolutely beautiful, look at this. They match identically. Gorgeous. So two piece set there. Number 61, I have two of the earrings available. Gotcha for the earrings, Christina. Gotcha for the earrings. I do have another pair of those, so it still can be a set if you wanted it to be. And I got to start y'all's baskets for this week, my gosh. It is the start of another freaking week. Crazy, isn't it? Crazy, crazy. Gotcha for the set, girl. Gotcha for the set. Let me start you a basket too, girlfriend. 
61 is gone, y'all. 61 is gone. Uh, now, the uh, next dilemma is finding y'all's name tags. I don't know why, but for some reason, for some reason, I always have an issue finding just y'all's name tags. Christina and Sarah. I don't know why. They're right there with everybody else. It is just for some reason your guys' likes to hide. Like, totally right now. Where is it? Let's see. There's Christina's. Now to find, now to find Sarah's. There we are. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Next blingo number 16. Blingo number 16. Lingo number 16. Anybody getting close yet? Anybody getting close on Blingo yet? All right, this one is a three-piece set, number 64 in brass. 64 set in brass. So this is brass on brass, y'all. Your metal is brass, your rhinestones is brass, it's all brass. Long set, there's your earrings that go with this, number 64, into your chain and your pendant. That gorgeous leaf that is fully encrusted in your brass rhinestones absolutely beautiful i love this one there's a long necklace we have the upgraded earrings brass on brass earrings that go with it and y'all know this one your cuff style bracelets in brass with your brass rhinestones. Y'all know this one because it is my favorite. I swear nobody's claimed it yet just so it will go in my inventory. So there is your three-piece set number 64. Number 64. Three-piece long necklace set, number 64, brass on brass. I know it's beautiful. What do y'all think of the necklace? Y'all like it? Is it gorgeous? Do you love it? This is that seed bead necklace I showed y'all. I told y'all, once, once you, um, I still have the black girlfriend. Um, I told y'all, once you put this on, like everybody falls in love with it. It's absolutely beautiful. I do still have the black necklace, girl. Um, I, I don't really have anything else that would go with it to make it a set, but I do have the black necklace. So if you want the necklace, let me know. Um, uh, just, just do 64 black necklace and I'll know. Blingo number four, blingo number four. Blingo number four. Is anybody getting close yet to Blingo? Anybody? Nobody? Maybe? Two, 
two piece long set number 46 long set it is um silver number 46 this is the asymmetrical necklace so those are the earrings that go with it you have that beautiful silver rolled chain into your pendant that asymmetrical pendant in the pink that is pink so you have two of these silver pendants here one of them has been dipped in rhinestones which matches the bottom of the main pendant which has also been dipped your center stone there is that beautiful beady pink and as you can see faceted stone absolutely beautiful get it off my shirt so it doesn't blend in there and then we have upgraded it with your baby pink um, teardrop earrings. Baby pink teardrop earrings in your silver. These, again, are super, super lightweight. Both of them combined weigh less than the cardstock. I do have two available of the earrings. Two available of the earrings. So if you would like those, that is awesome. So two-piece set there two piece set number 46 Let's see if we can put them somewhere a little there we go they're blending in with my shirt Lingo number five. Lingo number five. Lingo number five. Next one is a three piece set in your copper. Three piece set in copper. It is a short set. Number 65. There's the earrings that go with it. Your chain into your pendant. You have that double heart. One of them is encrusted in rhinestones, the other one is solid. Super cuteness right there. We've upgraded the earrings to your hoops, the small hoops with the inlaid copper rhinestones. We then have it paired with your cuff bracelet in the copper with that wave design in it so awesome beautiful so there is your three piece sets number 65 number 65 i guess it would help if y'all could see the number huh that would help wouldn't it Number 65. Lingo number one lingo number one nobody's answered is, is anybody getting close or no not yet
Nobody's talking tonight. That's cool. I'll talk to myself. It's okay. I ain't close on the blingo either. I'm not. <laughs> Wendy says sort of. <laughs> Number 78. This is a four-piece set. Number 78. Your earrings that go with this. This is silver and your black. Black center stone there. Adrian's three away. Woo -woo! Three away, she says. So black with your, um, it has like that rope design around the outside. This is that Tiffany inspired necklace. So it has the toggle switch. So there's your switch into your pendant. It matches the exact earrings identically. It's just a tad bit bigger. Short necklace. So you're looking right around in there. We, of course, upgraded the earrings because you might just want some bling going on instead of the matchy-matchy. So we got the black starburst earrings for that. Ooh, Cheryl's two away. Uh-oh. We have it paired with your cuff bracelet in silver. Cool thing about this one is the rhinestones alternate. So you have black and clear, black and clear all the way around this. It has that matching rope design on the outside of this. And it is beautifully um, rounded off in the back. This one is tight. Um, I actually had to. Um, Oh, Wendy's two away too. Woo -woo. So this one, um, a lot of our cuff bracelets, you can squeeze together to make them smaller. This one, uh, you can squeeze it a little bit, but it doesn't really stay there. Um, it's not, it's not pliable like like the copper one would be. The copper one that I showed y'all earlier, this one is very easily maneuverable. You can squeeze this one all the way closed if you wanted to, or open it some. To make it larger if you wanted to this one because look it is so thick you can't really do that one with this one but it is kind of tight um and once on like this um it definitely it definitely hugs my wrist you can see i don't have a lot of room in there um it, it hugs my wrist it's not going anywhere so um that was your third piece we have it paired with big back ring in silver and just plain silver with all the different textures. So you have that same kind of the rope look design on two of the um, two of the layers, and then you have this really gorgeous design on the other ones. So four piece set number seventy eight. Number seventy eight. And I'm gonna try to get this in here so y'all can see everything. There you go. Four piece set number 78. Everything on here, I only have one of. Only one of. <laughs> Graydon is, um, I think, very tired of being stuck in the house. Anytime you go near the shoes or the jacket or you open the door for fresh air, he is screaming at the top of his lungs, go, 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 I go, I go. And so that's what he's doing outside because Ryan is getting ready to take back his other kids and he gets to go. And so he's like all excited. So he's just screaming in the background, go, 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 go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, all right, y'all, I kind of lost track of which ones I showed you and which ones I haven't yet. Um, 
I don't think I showed y'all this one. See, I haven't had a board in so long that I'm like all thrown off on how this works. <laughs> I'm like, hmm, what do I do? What do I do? I don't know. All right. Three piece set, number 67. Three piece set. This is a long set. So there's the earrings that come with it. It is silver and your um, regular rhinestone. Your chain into your pendants. Beautiful. That is a black faceted center stone, haloed in two rows of rhinestones, and then haloed encased in silver. Beautiful. We have it paired with a cuff bracelet in silver that is a split shank and your pendant, your black encrusted pendant. So it matches your center stone there. And then we have you paired with big back ring in silver, fully laid out. Look, look at how much this matches. Look at that, see that? Amazing, right? Check it out, look at that. So you have that full center stone block, double haloed again in your rhinestones, just like your pendant. Gorgeous, it's gorgeous. And honestly, hold on y'all, hold on. Where'd they go? If you want it, if you want it, you could totally take these earrings from the, the set that I just showed you, the short set, and put it with it. Look at that. You could totally do that. So I have it paired tonight just this way. Number 67. I have it paired this way. But like I said, if you wanted, you could totally add in those earrings, and it is super pretty too. Look at that. Beautiful. Number 67 for that one. Number 67. All right. Bling number 33, bling number 33. Bling number 34. We're gonna call out a couple here. Bling number 34. Bling number 14. Bling number 14. Bling number 32. Bling number 32. Bling number 37. Bling number 37.
Bling number 27. Bling number 27. Bling number 10. Bling number 10. Bling number 22. Bling number 22. QP set number 87. QP set number 87. This is black and pink. Black and pink. So black is your metal color, pink is your stones on this one. Into your chain and your necklace. This one is so stinking cool. So you have two different versions of stones in here. You have an iridescent and a frosted which makes it look like it's different colored pinks, but it's not all the same. And then you have your hematite stones that hang in here periodically. So it is black and hematite, or pink and hematite, I'm sorry, pink and hematite. Your exact matching bracelets in that pink and hematite. Black is your metal color. This one does have a lobster claw clasp to it, so you can play with it. And the cool thing about these ones are they double as anklets, y'all. You can wear the class bracelets as anklets. And summer's coming, y'all. It's coming. So all those girls are going to be rocking out the cute anklets. Yes, yes. So that is set number 87. Set number 87. Bling number 25. Bling number 25. Bling number 25. <laughs> Cheryl still two away. Ah. Blingy? Is that you? Oh, bling. I was like, blingy, what's blingy? Blingo. Wendy got blingo. Wendy's got blingo. All right, Miss Wendy. I'm giving you two. I'm giving you two for winning Blingo. We're going to keep playing. Second runner up is going to get one piece. Second runner up is going to get one piece. So, number 59, this is rose gold, y'all. Rose gold two piece set. Castle style earrings that come with this one into your chain and your necklace. This is a V-shaped necklace. This one is turned on the card. There we go. So V-shaped necklace there. Look at all of the beautiful detail work on these pendants. It is absolutely beautiful. Rose gold. We have the exact matching bracelet to go with it. The exact matching bracelet that goes with it. This bracelet is a lobster claw clasp. 
So you can adjust to your wrist size. There's your extender so you can play. So two piece set there, rose gold number 59. Number 59. That don't work out very well, does it? Number 59. Rose gold two piece set. All right, bling number 12, bling number 12. Bling number 12. We are going to do runner up, runner up. This is a three piece set short set gorgeous spring set number 85 silver and baby pink pearl like stones into your chain and your pendant so your pendant there has has baby pink pearl like stones throughout it, mixed with your clear rhinestones. We have it matched with your earrings. We upgraded the earrings. Silver has your same baby pink stones that run throughout there, mixed with your rhinestones. Paired with big back ring in silver with your pink. This is this, it's not pearl, it is moonstone, but it is the same exact baby pink moonstone and your silver butterflies that run throughout that ring. This is one of the first spring items that Paparazzi released just a couple weeks ago. Beautiful. Well, there you go. Three piece set number 85. Number 85, three piece set. I guess it would help if y'all could see the uh, necklace, huh? There you go. Three piece set. Number 85. I have only one of each of all of those. Next lingo number 13. Lingo number 13. Lingo number 29. Lingo number 29. Lingo number 11. Lingo number 11. Lingo number 17. Lingo number 17. We are looking for runner up.
Blingo number 20. Blingo number 20. I only have, I only have one more set to show y'all. So we're gonna run through some numbers here. Lingo number nine, Lingo number nine. Lingo number 38. Lingo number 38. Lingo number 39. Man, nothing, y'all. Nothing. Lingo number 39. Lingo number 40. Lingo number 40. Lingo number 18. Lingo number 18. Now we're getting close, y'all. <laughs> we gotta be because I'm running out of numbers over here. Lingo number 35. Lingo number 35. <laughs> Mom needs one. Lingo number 35. Lingo number 36. Lingo number 36. Anybody? Nobody? Cheryl needs one. My mom needs one. I believe the only other person we had playing was Adriana. She's still here? Lingo number 36. And I only got, I only, I'm not going to show them to you, but I only got two numbers left, y'all. Two numbers left. I'm going to leave y'all in suspense while I show you the last set that I got. <laughs> it is a long set. Number 43. Number 43. Long set in black. All the way through. Black, black, black. So tassel style earrings that go with this. Into your chain and your pendant. You have those three elongated teardrop shapes there. They are not independent. It is all one piece. All one piece, black all the way through. And the exact matching earrings. Exact matching earrings. So two piece set number 43. Number 43, two piece matching set in black. That is your last set of the night. Y'all ready for your last blingo number? Drum roll, please. Anybody? Somebody, nobody? Last blingo number of the night. 
last, or I, at least it better be, considering y'all only need one. <laughs> one of these numbers has got to be for somebody. Lingo number 24. Bling number 24. Don't tell me y'all had the exact same number and this one's not it. Bling number 24. Did y'all seriously have the same number and that wasn't it? Lingo! My mom bingo! And just so y'all know, the last number was number 19. Blingo number 19. So I had all the numbers here. All the numbers. 1 through 40. 1 through 40. They were all mixed up. I literally set them smack dab on my table like this, and I called the ones that were on top. So we had, we had 15, 31, 23, 38, 28, 3, 7, 6, 26, 21, 2, 16, 4, 5, 1, 33, 34, 14, 32, 37, 27, 10, 22, 25, 12, 13, 29, 11, 17, 20, 9, 38, 39, 40, 18, 35, 36, 24, and 19. So, oh, Miss Wendy was our first lingo winner. She gets two pieces tonight. Second runner up was Mom. She gets one piece tonight. Was there anything you guys saw tonight that you liked um, or wanted? Um, or even in past shows, I did a flash sale today. I did some of these same sets today in the flash sale. Um, let's see, yesterday I did a flash sale of long necklaces only. Um, the day before that, I think I did rings. Um, yeah. You guys see anything that you liked tonight that you wanted holler it out let me know Anybody? If Cheryl saw one, give her mine. Aw. Miss Cheryl, 
Is there, was there anything that you saw tonight that you wanted? My mom is giving you her piece. Is she still here? Is Miss Cheryl still here? What about you, Miss Wendy? Did you see anything? Uh, it just said that she was on. It literally just popped up and said that she was watching. Um, I don't know, maybe she's just not paying attention, I don't know. Okay, no worries, you let me know, okay? Let me know, let me know. All right, y'all, was there anything else that you guys wanted to see again? If not, that's that's it, that's all I had to show for you guys tonight. Um, what y'all think of having sets back? What do you think? Like having sets back? I know it's different for me to have my, uh... oh, you're fine, Wendy, no worries. Um, I know it's different for me to have my board over here. <laughs> I'm telling you what, I appreciate you guys um, like being on board with that um, group invite because let me tell you that made it so much easier tonight to just, um, hi Jerry, to send out one thing to one space and y'all like literally jumped on at the same time. That was totally amazing. I was like really awesome I love it I love it um, so I did tell y'all in that group that if you knew somebody that you know would like to be a part of these live shows by all means feel free to invite them um, you can let them know you know that if they don't want to be there they can leave at any time if they don't like their phone going off all the time um, you know you can mute the conversation that way it's not blowing up all the time but I did make sure to put in there that this was for invites only it's not communication um, it's not for y'all to you know like reach out to me and claim pieces or anything like that you guys know how to do that personally with me instead of involving everybody else um, I only did the group literally just to make it a thousand times easier to send out invites because unfortunately this uh, social media platform is not real user friendly um, and um, for me to send out invites it, it's like switching in between accounts and as you can see I'm like on another device at the same time while I'm on my computer and it's you know your own you can send out invites a certain way for this much but you can't send them out the same way for the next batch so it was just like chaos so it's so much easier so much quicker to just send that one invite to y'all that was like amazing tonight i'm like ecstatic seriously oh i'm sorry it's okay, no worries. You can get back to me. Wendy, you actually have two free pieces right now. Um, one from the other game that we played the other day, I think it was, you won. So you had a free piece from that. Um, and then one from tonight. So you have two coming. Cheryl, you have one coming to you and by all means yes you can you know go back and 
watch the, the replay or whatever, or if you have a piece in your mind right now that kind of stuck out to you, I'll be more than happy to show it to you again right now. Um, or just let me know. You can always, I believe you have my info, so you can reach out to me or you can have Christina reach out to me too. That works too. What did y'all think of Blingo? Is that a game that y'all would like to keep around? Um, was it too chaotic? Were you not sure? You loved it? What do you think? Oh, I'm sorry, two from tonight. I'm sorry, two from tonight, Wendy. Yes. Fun? Good, okay. That's one vote. What about everybody else? What about everybody else? Sarah says fun. Christina says fun. There's two votes. Cheryl said it was fun. Three votes. I know, Wendy, I'm sorry. You have three. You have three coming to you. Wendy liked it. Um, well, I was I was telling y'all in the last live, you know, I um I can see where Family Feud wasn't fair to everybody because everybody's delay is different, unfortunately. So some of y'all were hearing the question long before anybody else did and so therefore you, you kind of had like the upper hand you know um so I was saying that you know I've been trying to think of other games where it would it would be fair you know um that you know everybody was given you know a fair shot a fair chance at winning so Blingo was one that had come up um and I'm trying to think of some other ones. So if you guys have any ideas or suggestions, by all means, let me know. Um, I know we played the emoji game, um, but I don't know, the last couple times with the emoji game, and again, I don't know if it's this platform or what's going on, but the last couple times we've played the emoji games, I'm not seeing everybody's emojis that says that they're playing. So, um, if I can't see them, then I can't count them, obviously. So that kind of rules them out too, which means it's not fair for them either. So I'm trying to find things that are fair for everybody to play. So I'm welcome to suggestions, y'all. I'm welcome to suggestions. Throw them on out there. All right, y'all. Um, there will be flash sale tomorrow. We will be having flash sales every day until, I think it's next week sometime. Um, so you will see me every single day, <laughs> sometimes twice a day. Um, flash sales, if you guys have not been able to jump on a flash sale yet, flash sales are super quick. Why? Because they're only one category. So, um, like today I did a flash sale on sets, but obviously I didn't show all of the sets that I showed tonight. I only picked like three or four sets and that's what I did in the flash sale. Yesterday I did a flash sale on only long necklaces. The day before that I did a flash sale on only rings. Um, so it goes quicker because I'm only showing one category and I don't go into a ton of detail about the jewelry like I usually do on my live shows. It is super quick. Um, for instance, if I was going to do a flash sale and I was showing these earrings, I would literally say they're silver with baby pink and rhinestones and I would move on to the next one. That's it. That's all I'd say. Um, so even though I'm showing you a hundred pairs of earrings, it goes super quick because I'm not doing massive detail. Um, so the flash sales usually run anywhere between like five minutes to like 20 minutes, maybe, if that. 
Um, I, I have been doing them during the day, um, but you guys can always go and watch the replay. I leave the numbers on the flash sales until either that night or the next day, depending on if I have a live that night or not. So if, if it's a regularly scheduled live day, then I will only keep the numbers on until that night. If I not, I'll keep them on until the next day. Um, but I know my inventory, y'all, even if the number's not associated with it, if you guys just screenshot me the piece, or if you describe the piece to me, I know my inventory and I'll know which one you're talking about and I'll get it pulled for you if it's still available. All right. All right, guys, um, be on the lookout for the update for hashtag Ryan in a tutu movement. Um, I believe we are pretty close to halfway, I believe. Halfway, and it's only the 15th, so we can do this. Um, so far in the drawing for the Z piece, we have Erin, Wendy, my mom, and Cheryl. Um, those are the people we have in the drawing for the Z piece. Everybody who purchases from me through the month of March is put into that drawing. Um, so if you feel like I've missed somebody, let me know. I've been trying to write them down as y'all purchase from me. So, um, but those are the ones we have so far. All right. Oh my gosh, y'all. It's like, I don't know. It's like every night at like 8, 8.30, my phone starts blowing up with all the emails from every single place I've ever purchased from in my entire life about the precautions they're doing with this stupid coronavirus. I'll be glad when it's over, y'all. Glad when it's over. Okay, we're gonna call that a night. For those of you who, out there who do still have invoices open with me, um, I am letting you slide until tonight, till tonight, okay? If I don't have in, um, paid invoices by tomorrow morning when I wake up, your stuff is going to be put back into stock, okay? So I do have a few of you out that still have invoices due, all right? Um, I hate to be the bad guy, but it's gotta happen. I'm sorry. I still love you, but it's gotta happen. All right, y'all. Thanks for jumping on with me tonight. I appreciate it. I hope you guys had some fun. Um, for those of you who have the pieces, I do have them wrote down. You can get back with me. You don't have to claim them tonight. You can claim them whenever. Um, no worries, okay? I will see you guys all tomorrow for the flash sale. Or if not, next scheduled live will be... Next scheduled live will be um, Wednesday night. Wednesday night, all right? An update? Um, yes, when I get off my live right now, hey Jay, when I get off my live right now, um, I will be doing an update. So be on the lookout for that picture. But I believe we are pretty close to halfway. I'm, I'm pretty sure. I was kind of doing the math in my head the other day, but I'm pretty sure we're close to halfway. Yeah. What's up, Jay? What you doing? Are you bored? You came on the Amy Shopping Network? Maybe we should, maybe we should rebrand the show, y'all. You know how, like, they have QVC and whatever? Maybe we should rebrand me. Dre's Shopping Network, or <laughs> Amp Shopping Network, Amp Shopping Channel, on the way home, from where?
where did you go? Out in this madness. No answer? Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Great and shopping network. Yeah. Just keep it as is. Dre's shopping network. Golfing? This late at night? You're golfing? What? Golfing don't stay up this late. We need somebody, is anybody out there good at creating logos? Can anybody create logos out there or is good at it or knows somebody or whatever? What do you think? Can we come up with a logo for Dre's shopping network? Hours ago? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, he created yours? Oh, cool. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'll get with you and we'll, we'll figure out. We'll create something or something. I don't know. I mean, it's not necessary, but we can. We can have fun with this, right? That's the joys of owning your own business. You do what you want and make it as fun as you want. <laughs> we got a thumbs up from the shark monster, y'all, or whatever that is, or a dinosaur. Is that a dinosaur? Looks like a dinosaur. <laughs> All right, y'all, we're going to jump off for the night then. Absolutely. That's the joys of it. I love it. I love it. All right. We're jumping off here. We are jumping off here. He likes dinosaurs. He does like dinosaurs. Yeah, he does like dinosaurs. I think we're going to do a, a truck birthday for him, though, because he's, like, big into his truck. I hate to start the Batman thing already. I mean, I know he'd love it, but I don't know if I'm quite ready to start another crazed Batman fanatic. Just don't know if I'm ready to start that yet. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, my oldest son, he's 12 now, but he started completely falling in love with Batman when he was about three, three and a half. And fanatic is like not even the word. Um, this boy still owns every single Batman camp castle out there and toy. He has collectibles. He has, oh my gosh, crazy insane amount of Batman. Okay. If he ever wanted to open up his own Batman store, he's set. I'm telling you. Um, and he's had these toys since he was that age. So what is that? Nine years he's had these toys. Um, and yes, he played with them all the time, all the time, all of them, but, um, they still look brand new because my son just, I don't know. He's very particular about his stuff and he takes very, very good care of his stuff. So, um, now 
my little guy has been commandeering all of Brothers of Batman stuff. And so every time we go and pick up little man stuff, we find a new Batman in the mix, or we find a car in the mix, or he's dragged out Brothers Castles, or something. <laughs> yes, the mask. Yes, he's still got it. It's up in his room. Um, so yes, he's been slowly commandeering all of his brother's Batman stuff, and he is, I think it's a little late. I think he's already fallen in love with Batman, but I'm just not ready to take it to that level yet. I'm not ready. So we're gonna, we're gonna steer clear as much as we can of the Batman so far. So far. Until he's old enough to go to the stores and pick out his own stuff. And then, I don't know, I might be in trouble. But then again, I could be like, we already have that one. It's at home. We don't need that one. <laughs> you know? All right, guys. We're calling it a night. I will see you guys tomorrow for the flash sale. Um, if you can't make it, that's totally okay. I will see you guys on Wednesday for the scheduled live. I hope you guys have a great start of your week tomorrow, and we will talk to you guys all soon. Thanks for jumping on with me tonight. Bye.